Hi guys, it's Barnaby outside the stadium light where Spurs got a 1-0 victory last. I've got James with me, who uh, is not only a Spurs fan and a member of the Glasgow Sports Club, but also author of a book called In Search of Alan Gilzean. Check that out. Is it available on Amazon, James? It is uh, available on Amazon, Barnaby, yes. That's where to check it out. But more importantly, for now anyway, what did you make of that game? Uh, very tight. Uh, the kind of game that we won last season with late goals, uh, mostly Ericsson weighing in with a late, a late screamer. Uh, and in many ways, the, the Mason's goal was equally as spectacular because I think some of the interchange and play and the build up to it was fantastic. I was really impressed by Lamella when he came on. I thought Townsend looked uh, very assured. Um, I was quite pleased to see that and rather than looking to, to shoot from distance, he was checking for a pass. Uh, couldn't agree more with what you said, especially about Lamella. I've not always been Lamella's greatest fan, I'd say, but I'll give him credit where credit is due. He really came on and, and looked for those kind of one and two touch passes, which we had been, we'd been lying on the game a bit more. Uh, anyway, just thinking about the next couple of games before we wind it up, City, uh, but before that Crystal Palace, can we get some good results in those games, you feel? Palace is going to be a real challenge. Obviously, it started very well, very impressive. Uh, and, you know, Balassi always gives us problems. Um, and, you know, I, th I think at the lean last season, we're very lucky to get away with a nil-nil. That's, that's a big, that's a massive result today. You know, getting the first three points on the board is always huge. And, uh, you, you know, it's, it's how we kick on from here. I mean, it depends how, what's happened with Mason. Bentaleb's out for any length of time as well. Starting to look a bit, a bit uh, short in numbers in the middle of the park. And likewise, you know, we didn't have an option for Kane today. Kane's still out of sorts despite the two goals for England in midweek. You just kind of feel that that chance at the back post later on last season was in the back of the net. And, and you got to sort of, it's not a worry, but, you know, with Son and NG still to come in, well, Son obviously played today, but with NG still to come in, and you know, it'll be interesting to see. It'll be interesting to see what he does on Thursday night because you know we don't have someone through the middle. We've got the we've got the police hanging us off, guys. Just quickly, let us know if you agree with what James had to say in the comment section below, and don't forget to subscribe to channel on YouTube. Thanks a lot, James. Appreciate it. Bye bye.